chapter 1 reproduction in organisms reproduction is a biological process in which an individual gives rise to an offspring means new generation which are similar to itself similar to parental individuals it means that an elephant produces an elephant only a human being produces human being only a parrot produces a parrot only a potato plant produces potato plant only so this is a meaning of producing the similar offsprings as a parental organisms what is reproduction reproduction is a process by which every organism ensures the continuity means on this earth or the biodiversity the species should survive for a very longer durations they should be present here for millions of years to have their presence on this earth or the biosphere the organism should have the continuity it is possible only by the process of reproduction it is the process through which organism produce young ones means whenever the process of reproduction occurs the newly formed one are very young individuals which in turn mature to give rise to the young ones see the cycle so the parent produces young one young one they mature again they produce another generations it is a process of producing its own kind generation after the generations it is the main perpetuation of the life now if we ask why the living organisms are there on earth why there is a so many that is a various species are found it is mainly because the main important aim and objectives of the living organism or the perpetuation of the living organism is reproduction now the process may be as simple as a cell division with or without formation of the fusion of gametes in the sense here broadly we say that the process of the reproduction occurs by the cell division which is a very simple mechanism or by the producing the gametes by both the parental individuals it may or may not bring variations so whenever the reproduction occurs every time we cannot expect the changes in the species it may or may not reproduction has played very important role in speciation and evolution of living organisms so on earth we have diversified species are present approximately we say that there are more than 35 million number of species are present means this is possible only because of the process of reproduction in organisms the period through which a certain organisms lives is known as a life span now we are learning another concept here what is that what is life span means there is a duration of an organism from its birth till to the natural death we call it as the life span of an organism life in living organism is a sum and total of living activities of the organism then how do we say that there is a life in living organism a no, very simplified uh, definition is it is a sum and total of all the living activities of the organisms we may again try to recall what are the living properties having a cellular structure having the protoplasm within the cell having the metabolic activity or the vital activities like in plants photosynthesis respiration transpiration absorption of water etc if you take animals we have the process of digestion excretion circulation nervous coordination etc what these are these are the vital activity it means it's all metabolic and structural properties they are functional in living organism the life span varies from few minutes to thousands of years we have a chart and we know which organism survives how long when we come to the process of reproduction broadly the whole process of reproduction can be classified into two different that is the types or the methods one is asexual method of reproduction the second one we call it as the sexual method of reproduction 